I'm going to try to um, install this tranny cooler underneath my truck. I've got a, I've already got a true cool 40 in the front, but I want to make some more room for the intercooler. So I'm going to mount it underneath the truck, underneath the cab. I'm going to use this derail. That's the part number. It's got a little fan on it. It's got a little thermal switch that turns the fan on once it hits a certain degrees. I'm not sure what degrees it is. It comes with a bunch of fittings and stuff. For 6AN and some barbed fittings. But uh, I'm going to try to use some hard line. I've never done anything with it before. But I bought these uh, B-nuts from Earl's. Just kind of slide those on and flare the middle line. It's a rigid, it's a 30, 37 degree flare. Uh, this is part number I'm using. So, I think I got this 3 8 line off of Amazon, I think. But, uh, and I don't have a bender for it, so I'm just going to use this tubing bending stuff. See how that works. Got a relay for it. And I'm gonna mount it up under the cab right here in front of the fuel tank. I use these rivet nuts. I like to use them pretty good. You don't have to have a, it's a, it's a lot easier than putting a nut on the other side, not needing a backup and stuff, so. This is the tool I would use. It's from Astro. Works pretty good. Just use these little Rivet. All right, I've got the tranny cooler installed, bolted up. I had to put a couple spacers, just some little plastic spac spacers I had laying around. I got the lines made. That's the first time making hard lines. Um, it's kind of a pain in the ass, but uh, once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. I think I might put a little bracket to tie these two together and hold them but they're pretty rigid um looks pretty good i had to it took me about two tries before i figured out how to flare it right but not too bad it should be better than the uh push lock hose i was using i was afraid it was starting to rub and stuff i don't want one to blow out and catch the truck on fire so this is how I originally had the tranny cooler set up. If anybody wants to do it like this, uh, it comes with these little brackets. I just kind of cut them how I wanted them. And, uh, and then had the lines going out the bottom, but I'm about to pull it off.